All right, let me call. Uh, I'll give Jason a call. See what's up. Hey, hey, man. Uh, what's going on over there? Hey, man. How are you holding up? Uh, I'm doing all right. You know. How about you? Yeah, same old, same old. Yeah, just sitting here on administrative leave, you know, while they do the whole investigation or whatever. I mean, to me, it's a total waste of time. I told them there was an accident, but I guess they gotta, you know, check it out or whatever. Yeah, everybody's talking about it, man. Everybody talks about it like it's big news or something. And it doesn't help, you know, they know my history with her and... Yeah, um, well, it wasn't a secret that she got on your nerves. Yeah, but she fucking got on everybody's nerves. I mean, come on. I mean, what'd she expect? Yeah, that's true. You know, it's like, oh, I need to cook my lunch and, and screw up the microwave and destroy the break room. Or when it comes to work, oh, can you do this for me? Can you, you know, get this for me? Because, you know, I don't know how. I'm apparently borderline brain dead. I mean, for God's sakes, it's part of your job. Get off your ass. It won't kill you. Well, I guess, technically, you know. Well, the way it happened, though, you gotta, you gotta feel sorry for a little bit, right? I really, I can't, I can't even figure out why she was even, you know, in that area. You know, you're supposed to stay away from the forklifts. I mean, it's what, 10, 10 feet or something like that? Uh, especially when they're moving. I mean, she's not exactly the biggest person in the world. I didn't even see her coming. That's true. It's just you. When they interview you about it, you gotta watch what you say. Because you gotta show some sympathy, too. Well, I know. I have sympathy. I mean, she's dead for fuck's sake. But, you know, she was being fucking stupid and getting in the way. That's the whole point. I mean, as usual. Probably was all pissy about it, too, because she had to get up and do it herself. You know, arguing with the guy who was supposed to do it for her. Do you feel any guilt whatsoever? I mean, she made my life a miserable fucking hell on a daily basis when she was alive. And now she's making my life a miserable fucking hell after she's fucking dead, for Christ's sake. I, she's just a non-stop pain in my ass. She was a pain in everyone's ass. But I don't think anybody deserves what happened. You know what, let's... Let's just agree to disagree on that. All right, man, just uh, get back to me later. We can talk about it some more. Yeah, talk to you later. See ya. What's up? What the fuck? Are you serious? Are you serious right now? Is somebody fucking with me? Ha <sighs> <sighs> ha, <sighs> ding dong ditch. Knock on the door, run away. <laughs> Not funny, little fuckers. Fuck. How is that? I'm not taking any chances. Get my fucking guy.
Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Easy there, partner. I don't know who the fuck you are, but you can get out, and you can be carried out. Okay, don't do it. Fuck, am I? Are you fucking serious? You gonna kill me, huh? <laughs> 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 all about this is what you call a confrontation confrontation about what the so-called accident <laughs> the forklift accident that's just what it was an accident it's in my report she was where she didn't belong it's her own damn fault now, that's what I'm talking about I, I, I don't understand what am I supposed to feel guilty or something from some her being stupid? Do you feel any guilt whatsoever? Why should I feel guilty? Oh, 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 because I didn't like her. Everybody knows that I didn't like her, that worked there. That doesn't mean I killed her on purpose. You know what? If I killed her on purpose, she's somebody I saw every day. I worked with her. What makes you think I will just as easily kill someone? Police ranger comes wandering into my house. Looking for this. Fine. You know what? You want to get some sort of revenge or whatever it is for the accident? Do what you gotta do. So, what are you gonna do about it? It's not what I'm going to do. It's what you're going to do. You're still not getting it. Well, let me make it abundantly clear. The first trade you encountered was the guilt. Wasn't very big, was it? Even mixed in with a little bit of fear. You even said it yourself. The bitch had it coming. Of course. 
course, you still tried to fight with your guilt. Which led you into a world of confusion where you tried to run from your guilt, ultimately bringing you right back to your fear. And what did you do to fight your fear? You became enraged. The second stranger, your rage. And oh, you are full of rage. And it damn near killed you. But instead, it brought you to this point. Your fear mixed with your rage. And you get me. Or, more to the point, you get you. Now, you have a decision to make. And I'm gonna help you make it. That was a that was a hell of a hallucination or a dream or whatever the hell it was. You know what? I think I like to think of it as an epiphany, if you will. A what? A moment of clarity. A moment to realize I need to stop being such a chicken shit. Just if there's something out there, I gotta go for it. You know, I mean, yeah, some people may get hurt along the way if necessary. You know, theoretically, and maybe, you know, maybe literally, I don't know. But I just got to be able to get up and just pull the trigger, you know what I mean? Yeah, I know what you mean. So, you fucking ready? I'm ready. <laughs> Are you ready? Oh, my friend. Oh, yeah. Fucking ready. Let's do this. Let's go. Oh, yeah. That's going to be great. Me and Jason off on some great adventure, right? You know, just like uh, Butch and Sundance, yeah. Rob a bank or, or uh, rob a train. Uh, hell, who cares, you know? Finally you get to be that, uh, that great hero I've always wanted to be. Or, hell, even be a villain. <gasps> Definitely get a bigger gun. But, that's, that's not what happened. He helped me make a decision. And I, uh, I pulled the trigger. But to be honest, uh, I put the gun against my head first. Well, at least this death won't be an accident. Ah, fuck it. Who am I kidding? I'm dead. What are they going to do? Her death wasn't an accident either. I saw the chance and, oh, it was beautiful. Only got one thing to say. Rest in peace, bitch. <laughs> Confusion of darkness. Whispers in the shadow. Dangerous anger hidden inside. Confusion. Split personalities. Whispers in the darkness. Dangerous whispers in the darkness, anger, and confusion. <laughs> <laughs>